Good morning and welcome to The Home Show. Mike Pace is my name and today we're going to show you dozens of Iowa Realty listings and open houses all around the metro, single family, townhomes, condominiums in every price range. We'll also chat with Dan Rivenberg about the advantages of working with our company. And Diane Todd Brown will be here to talk about a great Iowa home on beautiful Cassidy Drive on Des Moines' great south side. And here's a guy that knows a little something about the south side, Joe Henry from Iowa mm. Realty is here. Joe, great to have you back. Yeah, thank you for having me here. Appreciate good. it. We were chatting before going on camera, and I grew up in Norwalk. You grew up on the south, south side, side, and they've always been simpatico because yes. they're so close. That's right. And here we are with the ridge that kind of brings it together. We call it the new south side from Des Moines. Got it. Yes. That, that works. Yes. So we're talking about Norwalk here and the uh, village on the ridge, the ridge at Echo Valley, that beautiful country club golf course setting, site of a recent home show. Yes, it is. And here we are with 34 lots that were available. Now we're down to 28 lots have been sold, 28 wow. houses. I think so last time you were here, uh, since then we've sold several. We sold four. Wonderful. Sold four. Two, two are built to order and two were yep. already up. Yep. So now we have the baby that's up for sale. That's the one that's finally done for 379 one. Okay. Yeah, and it has a great backyard that's what it. Now we need to mention that these are villas, which uh, translates to a single family structure with Stand no common wall, but townhome amenities. Correct. These are in reality, single family homes mm -hmm. uh, with a townhouse in a townhouse development. Finish lower levels, nine foot high ceilings, big living rooms, big master bedrooms, um, in many of the rooms, hardwood floors, all the upgrades that you would expect at a very affordable price. Well, and Hubble Homes, our builder here, Iowa's largest builder, uh, just a stellar reputation for 160 years, dry basement guarantee, uh, brand names everywhere, in-house warranties, uh, things that not, not every builder can give right. you. Right, well, you, you have the customization at, at, a, at a spec price that's a lower price than any, any other competitor out there. And again, with the finished lower levels, you have three bedrooms, three baths, uh, granite and coarse countertops in the kitchen and the bathrooms. Uh, it just, it's, it's an amazing type of program. Cement board siding on the outside. Just many updates. Right, and of course, Norwalk has changed so dramatically since uh, I was there years ago. Where the growth is, is wonderful. The schools are growing, tax abatement on new construction for savings. And there is no better place from which to commute into Des Moines. Correct. I mean, where this is located, the ridge is within 10 to 15 minutes of West Des Moines to the mall there, downtown Des Moines. You can get anywhere you want. $5,000 in Hubble bucks if you can uh, hurry up and get your deal put together and close by the end of the year, right, Joe? Correct. And again, for 9422 Bellflower, which is the last one left mm -hmm. that's been constructed. You get $5,000 in Hubble bucks. You can use that for upgrades on the inside, for appliances, whatever you want. And you'll be there today? I will be there. We'll send them out. Good to Thank see you. you. Come back soon. you too. You bet. When I mentioned home services lending is always the uh, preferred lender when you work with Hubble Homes. Diane Todd Brown will be here shortly. We'll be talking about a great Iowa home on the south side of the city. The Ascent says, Des Moines is the number three best city in the United States for high salaries and low cost of living. West Des Moines with Darla Willett Rorson and a brand new price of $390 and a $9,600 whole home TV sound system now included. Walkie schools here, fresh open plan, great kitchen, again, 390. Next up, Cheryl Corbett, open house today, 1230 to 230. 329 is the list price. Four bedrooms and three baths, nice eat-in kitchen, big master suite, lower level uh, family room and playroom, triple garage, 329. Rick Wanamaker with six bedrooms, five baths, meticulously cared for two-story in the village of Ponderosa. Great location, price tag of $599.9. It is absolutely loaded. Look at that view. Next up, Layla Granger in West Des Moines with a two-bedroom townhome, two bath areas. This is West Park. Great location, schools, parks, shopping, and entertainment nearby, established neighborhood, new stainless appliances, clubhouse and pool, price of $178.9. Jacob Taylor, three bedrooms, three baths, a nice three bedroom home, a big deck and backyard. Lower level is finished nicely with the knotty pine, a lot of extras here, and a price tag of $257.9. Danny Ivankovich, 
As we go to Urbandale, townhome living, two bedrooms and two baths, views of mature trees and wildlife here, nice open concept floor plan. Living room is a big one, kitchen with plenty of cabinetry, storage 147.9. Tom Hyde in Urbandale says, why rent? Just listed condominium with nearly a thousand square feet. Great location. All the appliances stay. The paint, the carpet, the flooring, the lighting, the appliances, the countertops, everything almost is new. 79.9. Brianna DiCarlo with three bedrooms, a walkout ranch in Urbandale, 2,200 plus square feet on the main level. About half an acre here backing up to Colby Woods bike path. A new roof, new uh, heating and cooling, 349.9. Elaine Johnson from Iowa Realty with three bedrooms and three baths. First time home buyer, take a look here. Open vaulted living room, wood burning brick fireplace, new carpeting, a lower level finish with a family room, big double garage, 224.9. Nancy Willis, townhome living at Cobblestone. Great location, immaculate two bedroom townhome with updated kitchen, lower levels of walkout, first floor laundry, gas log fireplace, radon mitigation, 174.9. Jamie Edkins, price tag of 325 with four bedrooms and four baths. Lots of updates here. Kitchen with new stainless steel appliances, oversized covered deck with new composite flooring. Uh, again, lots of updates, 325. The original builder here, Accurate Custom Homes, a five bedroom, two story with five bath areas, wonderful chef's kitchen, amazing indoor and outdoor entertaining spaces, walkie schools, big three car garage, and a price of 554. This is Clive, and look at the views that you'll have from this wonderful townhome over Country Club Lake. Three bedrooms, five bath areas, high-end everything, a lower level finished. It's a walkout, and Ken will be there this afternoon. Tracy Ox in Waukee with two bedrooms and two bath areas in this townhome has lower level potential for extra square footage, a maintenance-free living here with lawn care and snow removal taken care of for you. This is near the Waukee Triangle, great location, and 169.9. Melanie Stanbro, three bedrooms, three baths, another nice townhome in Waukee, 2,600 plus square feet here, two fireplaces, lower level with 1,300 square feet down. you back to a beautiful creek and trees, 234.9. Another wonderful townhome, three bedrooms, three baths at Glen Village, a conservation community in Waukee. $5,000 in Hubble Bucks if you hurry. Deborah McGee can tell you about that. Nice two story, priced at $234.5. Better than an acre and a half, uh, the setting here, wonderful trees, nice brick ranch country feeling at Fox Creek. Lots of updates, plenty of storage. Grand Prairie Parkway nearby, three bedrooms, three baths, $429.9. And Ron Braga, Mr. Contemporary, if you will, this home with a great modern flair is open today with Ron from one to four. Four bedrooms, four baths, 3,250 square feet at 569.9. Where well, this stately two-story sits on 3.3 amazing acres on beautiful Cassidy Drive on Des Moines' south side, magical park-like neighborhood. And Diane Todd Brown is here to tell us about this great Iowa home. Nice to see you. Thank you. You know, this, this street has always been kind of a magical street. Big, beautiful yards and wonderful homes. Yes, and just a lot of kids and just a great street and two minutes from downtown. Oh my, the location, uh, airport downtown, Wakanda Club, uh, Waterworks Park, Gray's Lake, uh, the bypass is pretty handy. It's just a wonderful spot. And this home, is it just sparkles. Yes, it does. It's in pristine condition. Newer windows, kitchen, baths, everything has been redone. Yeah. Well, we're going to take a look here at some wonderful photographs of this two-story. Uh, some nuts and bolts here, 3,330 square feet. And uh, it looks like it was built yesterday. Doesn't it? Yeah, it really does. Perfect condition. So tell me all about it, Diane. Give us a, a, some detail here. This home is sits on a hill and it has a park-like setting, um, the 3.3 acres, uh, very light and open. As you can see, these windows are all extra large. They're newer windows. Extra large really lets in the light and just a, a fabulous property. So now just some things that you're not going to see every day, the marble floors, uh, of course, the privacy and the elbow room. 
these great big beautiful windows, there's room for a pool in the backyard. Yes, there is, and, and it's surprising how many people now do want pools. Absolutely. Um, they have a two-car attached garage, and then they built a third garage, which looks like a two, and it has a uh, full bath, a full kitchen, and it looks out into a flat surface, which would be great for a pool. And there's room upstairs that it could be a fourth bedroom, it could be a guest quarters, pool house, whatever you'd like. Wow. If there you just joined us, this is Cassidy <laughs> Drive on Des Moines Great South Side, one of the prettiest streets in all of the metro right here. And this two-story. Uh, That's a lower level there. Yeah. This two-story is a great Iowa home, and Diane Todd Brown's given us the tour here. Of course, as beautiful as it looks, Diane, seeing it in person, it would really yes. give you the, uh, the big picture here. Wide open. Look at this backyard, the privacy. You feel like you're in the park, literally. Look at yes. that. Well, let's get to price. Okay, 825000 Bonafide bargain. And you sure couldn't build it for that. Oh and the lot is worth so much. It's just beautiful. Again, 3.3 acres, 825 with the rates. If you're not a cash buyer, the best in our lifetime. This could be your forever house. And Diane Todd Brown, of course, is at our Valley West office, right? Yes. Great. We'll have them give you a call. Give me a call. I'll show it anytime. <laughs> great to see you, Diane. Thank you. You can see more great Iowa homes, of course, at iowarealty.com. home can be stressful, so why make it a solo act? At Iowa Realty, our extensive team provides comprehensive marketing solutions. Love that natural light. Trusted financial guidance. It's a seller's market and a plan for every unexpected bump along the way. Oh, that was close. So you can sell your home faster and celebrate sooner. Your house is officially sold. Start your sale at iowarealty.com. Ready for that big move? Work with the company that knows the most about residential real estate in the state of Iowa, Iowa Realty. On the cul-de-sac in Ankeny, nice, well-cared-for two-story with three bedrooms and three baths, a nice kitchen with new cabinetry, soft clothes, doors and drawers, quartz countertops, triple garage, fenced yard, price of $279.9. Ashley Carter, four bedrooms and three baths in Ankeny, Updated ranch, more than 2,300 square feet here. Great access to I-235 or I-80. Open floor plan, wood floors. Updated kitchen, 287.9. Here's a nice Ankeny ranch. Has a big garage with a heated workshop area. Private backyard, lots of updates inside and out. Three bedrooms and two baths. A lot of charm here for a good price of just 194.9. Scott Steelman, as we go to Johnston, this is Crosshaven. You can enjoy the fire pit on these chilly evenings, private backyard, adjoining a nature area, four bedrooms, three baths, one of a kind ranch style home at 469. Joey Plummer, Hidden Valley Estates, $700,000 price tag on three quarters of an acre for this story and a half, backing to the trees, five bedrooms, four baths, absolutely loaded with quality and luxury, 700. Next up, this is Grimes, David Knudsen, four bedrooms and three baths. Johnston Schools here. Walkout lower level has been professionally finished. The roof, the water heater, the garbage disposal have been updated recently. A lot of nice features for 427.5. Bo Cousins in Grimes with three bedrooms and two bath areas. 3099 is the price. Nice master suite. Comfort height vanity there, dual granite sinks, big walk-in closet. Nice open feeling and a price of 3099. Three bedrooms and two baths. As we go to Windsor Heights here, Jan Steele, love to give you the tour. A lot of potential in the lower level. Upstairs, three bedrooms and two baths, double garage, lots of updates, big kitchen cabinetry, 235. A completely renovated Waterbury Beauty here, and Michelle Pulver, love to give you the tour. Three bedrooms, two baths, priced at 415. Finished walkout, lower level, all kinds of updates, again, 415. Just listed, and Amy Cahandra would love to give you a tour here. Updated ranch, quiet north side neighborhood, kitchen with stainless steel appliances, new cabinetry, new roof, new dishwasher, new LVP flooring, 189.9. John Smith, three bedroom home in uh, Beaverdale, nice secluded spot here, 2,160 square feet in this two story. Formal living and dining rooms with a bay window, a lot of updates, 235. 
Serge at TV from Iowa Realty would like to talk to you about this home. Be sure and ask about uh, a $10,000 forgivable loan. This is an NFC area of the city. You can walk to Frisbee Park from this spot. Lots of updates, 144.9. 149 is the list price here. Sunny Green with a two bedroom home. Again, an NFC area, which means a good size forgivable loan uh, could be available to you. It's a brand new price of 149 and updates in every direction. Now, Tanya Shira with something special here sitting on one acre, very stately south of Grand Four Bedroom Colonial in a park like setting. Downtown Des Moines, Ingersoll restaurants, uh, walking and bike trails, very handy. Lots of updates, 790. Jeff Kenyon with a Des Moines address, lots of updates here. It's a split foyer with fresh paint inside and out, nearly new windows, white kitchen, all the appliances included, 197.5. And again, lots of updates. Diane Todd Brown, something special on 3750 grand, the site of that wonderful old Christian Science Church. This is condominium living, totally unique. You won't find anything else like it in the city. Two bedrooms, two baths, 501-800. Karen Helgeson with a two-bedroom home, downtown condominium living, high ceilings, big windows, all the appliances, high vs across the street, farmer's market, nice and handy for you. There's a rooftop patio, 219.9. BJ Knapp says, don't forget tax abatement when you live at the Edison downtown condominium living. He'll be there from one to three this afternoon. Come and see what this is all about. And I love it, BJ says, the Edison is a bright idea. This is an amazing artisan townhome with seven years of tax abatement remaining. Just listed, Nita Number is the agent to talk to. Your pets are welcome, no lawn care, no exterior maintenance. Great location downtown, 357.5. Scott Mergen, three bedrooms and two baths. Everything here virtually is new. Oversized double garage, kitchen, bathrooms, plumbing, electric, windows, doors, and so on, 149.9 there. Chantel Cooney from Iowa Realty says, uh, how about a little sweat equity here? Why rent? This home will be sold as is. No repairs or improvements are going to be made, but uh, might be a great opportunity. Two bedroom home priced at $90,000. Sherry Skay with a three bedroom home. Windows and central air and furnace have all been updated. It's move in ready, well maintained, lower level potential, waterproof downstairs. And a price tag here of 159, three bedroom home, Des Moines South. Next up, Sue Randleman on the south side, west of Fleur Drive, completely remodeled four level split, all new cabinetry, countertops, flooring, sliders to the deck, walkout lower level, new carpet, and a good price of 227.5. Our guest today on the show, Joe Henry, with three bedrooms and three baths. This is an elegant, custom built two story, about a third of a wooded acre on the end of the cul de sac. Good uh, quality at Easter Lake, 334.9. Holly Krager says about 2,000 square feet, a little more here, two bedrooms and three baths. Nice open floor plan, skylights, hardwood floors, high end custom cabinetry. Good location, 389. Ken Kozlerich with four bedrooms and four baths. This is a custom built ranch. How about 6,100 square feet here on three quarters of an acre? 50 year shingles on the roof. A fifth non-conforming bedroom, possibly downstairs, 499.9. Logan Bryant says this could be a great first home for somebody. Four bedrooms and two baths, fully remodeled kitchen with all new appliances, 2,500 in closing costs with a full price offer of 149.9. And again, lots of updates. My guest right now is Dan Rivenberg from Iowa Realty, long time uh, professional with our company. Current title is Director of Business Development. And believe me, that's one of about nine hats this guy wears, right, Dan? Yeah. One of the busy guys. I try to stay busy. Well, you don't have to uh, pretend, I'll tell you that. We want to talk about Iowa Realty a little bit. Uh, we know we have new viewers uh, to our show, new viewers uh, to the Metro. Uh, and people who might be thinking about listing their home or maybe thinking about a career in real estate. Lots of reasons to have this conversation you and I are having. And there are lots of reasons to put Iowa Realty on your list. Yeah, you know, Mike, after spending 15 years uh, selling, uh, helping people sell and buy homes, um, I, I took a, a moment to kind of look back and see what we can do to help agents do the same thing I did for so long. Um, as well as take some of the, the wisdom that um, was imparted to me from some of the agents that were came before me. 
And we just looked at, uh, you know, I real estate school as being a great venue and a great platform to be able to do that. And um, when you're selling with, or buying with IRA Realty, specifically our IRA Realty agents, uh, you know that they've got the best training out there. They've got the best company backing them up um, and you can sleep easy knowing that you're in good hands. Well, we've been the leader for roughly 70 years in this market and training has been a huge part of that. I think if you got an honest answer from uh, uh, veteran agents, even from other companies, they would say that Iowa is known to have had all these years the best training. Mm -hmm. And it continues. And of course, uh, you know, there's a lot involved in training nowadays uh, to get the knowledge that you need to really be a pro. Yeah, you know, we, we strive to be able to uh, give our agents the best opportunities out there, uh, both for enrichment and uh, continue education. Uh, you know, I came up learning from one of the best trainers um, that Ira, Iowa um, realtors have seen from Tim Aline. Right. So I'm, uh, I'm a kind of a disciple of his. And I look at it the same way that he used to, is he is making um, the agents better by um, sharing the knowledge that he has. Mm -hmm. And that's what we try to do. We've got several uh, people in and around the I Real Estate School that are um, uh, part-time realtors as well as full-time realtors uh, that are uh, trainers for us. So they're in it every day and they're teaching that to our agents as well. Well, n nowadays it's a 60 hour course roughly and then there's continuing education. And of course, Iowa uh, can help you if you're thinking of uh, being a professional Iowa really person help you with that even virtually nowadays. Yep, we've uh, adapted our platform here um, for obvious reasons to go uh, to 100% virtual right now. So if you don't have the ability to get into an office or into uh, uh, 3501 Westtown to take a class, we can get it done for you right from the uh, comfort of your home. You know, uh, agents are independent. They have financial opportunities second to none. It's unlimited. Uh, and I think there's gratification uh, that comes with that paycheck. And those are the kind of people that I know you're looking for and they're out there. Yeah, it's really satisfying. You bet, Dan. Good to see you. Keep up the good work. Tell everybody at Corporate High. Will do. All right, Dan Rivenberg, our Director of Business Development at Iowa Realty. Working with a designer can actually save money. The design team at The Elements can help you stay on budget and spend your dollars where they will add real value. Art and accent pieces can help embellish but avoid extras that don't really add livability. Keep it simple. The Elements can help you navigate your project wisely and affordably from a single setting to your entire home. The Elements, in Storm Lake and at Prairie Trail in Ankeny. We're anything but ordinary. Des Moines is the number three top Midwestern city for women in STEM occupations. That according to Commercial Cafe. Brownstones at the Legacy in Norwalk. Townhome living uh, on the golf course, three bedrooms, three baths. Susan Vanderwall would uh, be the agent to call. Five-year partial tax abatement, quick commute into the city, quality living here from Hubble, of course. Angie Deemer is a resident of Norwalk. She can tell you all about it. Brand new listing here, three bedrooms and three baths with nearly 2,000 square feet. Hardwood floors throughout the main level, great kitchen, plenty of space, a good price of $194.9. Julie Samuelson with a Norwalk address. Good square footage here. This is Tanzanite, the builder. Finished lower level. Great price of $389,650. Spacious kitchen, corner pantry. There's a wet bar, big family room, and again, golf course living. This is Indianola and Emily Keller Lampman. Open house one to three today. Tax abatement on this home. Local builder, amazing finishes throughout. It's a neighborhood called Heritage Hills. Big triple garage near Indianola Country Club, 445. Paula Chu would like to show you this one owner home with a huge list of updates. She'll be there noon to two today. Again, backing up to that Indianola Country Club. Amazing views, triple garage and updates galore, 339.9. Carrie Bishop with another home near that Indianola Golf Club. Groundbreaker Homes here, about a third of an acre. Just steps to the Country Club. A lot of curb appeal, quartz countertops, hidden pantry, and a price of 419.9. Ellie Price will be in Pleasant Hill, open house one to three today, three bedrooms and three baths, a white kitchen, new wood look flooring, fenced yard. Uh, you could do some more finish downstairs for extra square footage. Good price, $229.9. Adele Caesar would love to have you give her a call and ask about this wonderful home. 
with an Adele address, obviously a proposed listing. Those charming brick streets and courthouse, five bedrooms and five baths here. A quick commute to the city, 895. Brandy Jankowski with an Altoona address. Great location, Ironwood Park in Altoona, three bedrooms, three baths, open floor plan, nice deck directly off the eat-in kitchen, and a price of 230. This is Knoxville, Arvin Van Warheisen uh, is the agent to talk to. It's a ranch, 3,700 plus square feet, a beautiful landscaped acre with a Knoxville address, 379.9. Connie Ridgeway with Boonville address, three bedrooms and three baths, and this is uh, just south of that landmark Waveland Cafe out there at Boonville. Uh, if you're an acreage lover, check it out. There's a pool on the property, 464.9. We go to Carlisle and Brady Jackson with two bedrooms and two baths in this well-maintained home. Nice open feeling. Good sized living room with fireplace, lots of oak cabinets in the kitchen. Bathrooms uh, have tile, downstairs partly finished, 174.9. We go to Carroll. North and west of the city, Teresa Knox with three bedrooms, two baths, about a half acre here, garages for four cars, even a workshop. And this is Carroll again, 189.9. A Peru address south of uh, Winterset in Madison County, 257 acres, amazing property. You need to see it to appreciate it. Some of it is tillable, but a hunter's dream, two bedroom home on the property, a million five ninety three and change. This is Truro, also Madison County, about 25 minutes to West Des Moines, five outbuildings on this property. The income from these buildings could produce enough to maybe pay the property tax, 450. We go to Van Meter, three bedrooms and three baths. Uh, Moore Homes is the builder, just minutes from Jordan Creek, Crestview Acres, open concept floor plan, available tax abatement, 414.9. Rachel Eller with a Winterset address, four bedrooms and four baths, walkout ranch on 30 acres, great schools, quick commute. You overlook a stocked pond, there's a geothermal system, and the price is $6.65. Well, don't let the sun set on this opportunity in our market. Uh, things are amazing right now for buyers and sellers alike. And thanks for joining us for the home show. We hope it's part of your Sunday morning at 10 a.m. every week here on Local 5. Until next time, Mike Pace, stay safe and have a great week. Working with a designer can actually save money. The design team at The Elements can help you stay on budget and spend your dollars where they will add real value. Art and accent pieces can help embellish, but avoid extras that don't really add livability. Keep it simple. The Elements can help you navigate your project wisely and affordably from a single setting to your entire home. The Elements, in Storm Lake and at Prairie Trail in Ankeny, we're anything but ordinary.